Dear Ones. The title of this video is Point of Origin, Ants and Silverfish, by Alice B. Claggett. It is a follow-up on my video First Contact, Ants and Silverfish. The questions raised today are, what might the X-ray peaks of the last few days tell us about the point of origin of prototypical ant and silverfish life on Earth? The image before you shows the X-ray peaks that produced radio blackouts on Earth from August 27, 2022 to August 30, 2022. Could it be that the X-ray influxes had to do with the ants creating a telepathic commotion during that time? Did you as well as I have that experience of ants telepathically carousing about in the last few days? I note that the X-ray peaks were caused by M-class flares. Some of these flares produced coronal mass ejections, but none of the CMEs impacted Earth's electromagnetic field. I got this from Space Weather, August 30, 2022 Archive, https colon slash slash www.spaceweather.com. Thus there would have been no scrubbing clean of misqualified dense new aspheric energies. By way of explanation, it is through the new sphere of Earth that telepathic thought forms circulate. The new sphere is the atmospheric envelope or postal service that transports thought forms from us to anywhere else on Earth, whether intentionally or unintentionally. As you may know, I posit ant life on Earth was created through a species soul DNA template deriving, with quite some modifications to suit our planet, from the Alpha Centauri star system, the Orion star system, or maybe from both. Aside from Alpha Centauri's red dwarf, there are two possibilities for origin of life in that star system, Alpha Centauri A and Alpha Centauri B. I see online that Alpha Centauri A has lower X-ray bombardment than Earth. If the DNA template for ant life on Earth derived from an as yet undiscovered planet orbiting Alpha Centauri A, then the X-ray bombardment yesterday might have made the ants in my house uncomfortable, and for that reason voluble. It is just as possible that the DNA template for ant life on Earth may have derived from an as yet undiscovered planet orbiting Alpha Centauri b, which has much more X-ray bombardment than Earth. Positing that prototypical alien ant life originating on Alpha Centauri b might have preferred high influxes of X-rays, then the X-ray bombardment on Earth in the last few days might have made my ants wildly enthusiastic and telepathically very voluble. Maybe the combination of X-rays and the very low rumbling sound of the vacuum cleaner might have done it. It seems the Alpha Centauri system's red dwarf Proxima Centauri, which has a planet circling round it, is out of the question as a possible point of origin for anti and star brothers and sisters. That is because of its life-threatening amount of solar flare activity. For more on that, see Mike Wall's article, Could Alien Life Handle the Radiation in Three-Star Alpha Centauri System? at space.com online. I note from online research that many free-floating planets have been discovered in the Orion Nebula, which is much farther from Earth than Alpha Centauri. It could be that ant-like life originating in Alpha Centauri has telepathically influenced alien life forms in Orion and on Earth or the point of origin and of emanation of life forms might have been inhabitable but yet to be discovered planets in Orion. Life forms attaining higher dimensional awareness, awareness fifth dimensional and beyond, are unshackled from the restrictions of time and space. Thus higher dimensional star brothers and sisters bearing the gifts of prototypical ant soul DNA and perhaps soul DNA of other insect e unstar species such as prototypical silverfish, might have originated on either of these relatively nearby star systems. Because of their ability to transcend time and space, they might bring these gifts to Earth from anywhere in the universe, 
possibly some place much farther from Earth than Alpha Centauri and Orion. Those are my thoughts on the point of origin of prototypical ant and silverfish life. God bless you all and keep you safe. And be with you through all your days. In love, light and joy. Alice B. Claggett. I am of the stars. For more first contact videos, see my playlist first contact at my YouTube channel Alice Claggett Author. For more very odd Claire Intel on ants, go to my blog Awakening with Planet Earth, https colon slash slash awakening with planet earth dot com, and search the word, anti-ants. The end.